Hello everybody, my name is Dizzy, and welcome back, wait for it, to Rokey. Uh, first off, welcome Boom Boom in the chat, lovely to see you popping up already. How are you doing? I hope you're having a wonderful morning. And by morning I mean it's technically afternoon now, but shush. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, so last time we uh we began this game, it's really cute. Uh and I caused the death of my dad by throwing a Molotov cocktail inside my house. Which is always fun. Uh hang on a second, I've got a bit of snuffles. Ah, oh, excuse me. Uh yeah, so we did that. Then our brother got kidnapped. We got away from the big fuzzy monster. And then the big fuzzy monster kidnapped our brother anyway, because I guess it didn't like losing. Uh, Boomer says, I was having a good morning, then it ended. Such is the way. Uh, sure, I guess. I hope this is the most recent thing I did. Ah, yes, okay, I remember being here. Fantastic. Oh, you flatterer. Uh, yeah, so here we are in, in Roki. We've got a, a, a stick with a wolf head on it. So we're looking for four guardians, one of whom is a wolf guardian. Presumably, that I need to, to go through this set of wolf statues for. And we've got to twist and turn this, presumably. And then we need to find another stick. Hmm? Odd place for a ram skull. That's what was on the list. Ah! Oh, I didn't even realise a ram skull was on the list. But it's good to know that we found one. This is a terrible idea, by the way. Don't do this at home. Just pre-climbing up a snowy, rocky wall. And if you're wondering what that infuriating tapping noise is... Ooh! Flowers! Hmm. A valerian flower. Ooh! Yay! I nearly missed that. Being watched, but by what? I need to be alive to help hmm. us. What would Papa do if he were here? You make a torch! Okay, do I have the materials for a torch? Maybe? No, okay. Boom says, it's now a good time to mention the time when I was a kid, me and my cousin scared a chalk cliff. Gosh darn it, Boom Boom. Okay, can't go in the cave until I can make a torch. Also, are those hands? Those look a lot like hands. Giant hands carved from ice. At least I hope they're carvings. Oh, okay. Thanks, hands. Am I being invited in? I guess. Oh, new badge. Follow the flow. Oh, this is a yellow badge. I don't even know what, what the different colours of badges mean. But the previous ones I've got have all been red badges. Okay. So we're now in a oh, in an ice cave with changing camera angles. Wonderful. More hands. They're playing harp. Oh well, they're playing strings. Oh, hello! There's a friendly friend in there. Are these are these hands all yours, sir? Of course you, child. You seek something. Let Fossagrim help you find it. I've heard of a Fossagrim hmm. before. My brother, a little boy, have you seen him? No child has entered our waters in such a long time. We hold many hidden things. Step in and see. <laughs> no. 
<laughs> when an old guy with a beard asks you to get in the bath with him, kid, don't say yes. My younger sibling would simply pull you beneath. Oh, you have a sibling, do you? I can't seem to lure in anyone these days. <laughs> I'm a spirit of water. Water is not nice. It flows with the notes of my song. It can nurture or destroy, depending on the melody. Uh huh. Do you have an instrument you wish to master? No. Shall you have an offering? Also, no. So, what brought you to my path? I need to get to the. Get, no, they're the guardian, guardians. Now, I leave no ripples on our ponds now. I can reach them, but I need a staff with a wolf head on it. Oh, that's me, I'm saying that. A rock creature brought something like this to me. What uses a staff? I require food for my services. She wished to enchant a flute to return her brothers, she said. Hmm. <laughs> Trollhilda. She gave her name. She was wise in one way, at least. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop trying to lure me. Okay. I'll show her some scraps of food that might interest you. Okay. I'll have a look around. Oh yeah, it's full of plates and stuff in like floating bubbles. I guess this is one way to avoid doing the washing up. There's a desire to master their music, to make it flow in them as the river, rise in them as the waves. Some even wish to command the water itself. Oh, that was in bold. To do this, they just need to bring you a meal. Their instrument in the meal. To control water, that can't be all that sounds too easy. Okay. You would like to gain this power for yourself, yes? Uh huh. You must satisfy these thirsty stones also. Their power will be needed for such an enchantment. Okay, how do we do that? You must absorb the power of the three springs. One that was large but now small. One that was clean but now tainted. And one that hides a tragic secret long forgotten. Okay, water is not always nice. Right, okay, so we've now got, I guess, sort of like two quests. We've got a quest to gather ingredients. Oh, hello. Smooth river glass. Oh, it's just a gem item, it's not a proper item. Yeah, so quest at the other um, temple for ingredients to make a potion, and quest at this temple for spring water for rocks, I guess? There's a tree around here somewhere. Hello. Oh, I haven't uh, opened you. Let's uh, do a choppy chop. Spit the birds away, and then it should open. There we go. Hi there, tree! Uh Hello? Okay, we got we got stuck a little bit. <laughs> you saved me, yes. Well, haven't we had this conversation? I feel like I freed you before. Great mother tree is having to find you. So I can use you as a portal, basically. Dear. Thank you for the door. We are reconnected. Wonderful. In we go. Okay. From here. Let's go talk to Trollhilda about that stuff. She's over here under the bridge. I hate that noise, it really gets to me. The bloody ravens pecking on things. 
Is that a bug? Oh, it is a bug, but it flew away. I think we now have two out of three flowers for our floral remedy. Hi there! Oh yeah, that flew. Hilda! I'm looking for something. I think you have a staff. Wolfie stick! Yes, Wolfie stick! Hilda gave to Troll Hulda to scare ravens from garden. Hulda is Troll's sister, a hedge troll, grows many things. Makes nice tea. Poor Hilda has no good tea. Okay. Uh, we met Hulda. I can't remember where we met Hulda, but we met Hulda. What's this? It's a tiny stream. Where did we meet Hulda? I have unfortunately forgot basically everything. Uh Pond, Breath Mill, Mule Cat, Poison Forest Cave Potions. Okay, that might have been Troll Holder, possibly. I think. Okay, let's guess that. She might have been around there somewhere. Now we're still looking for one plant. Or one flower, I should say. It's not that. Those are bluebells. Hey, old tree. I found a troll. <laughs> so you don't know how to react. I mean, one that's not moving, it's turned to stone. The old trolls. Theirs is a sad tale. Long ago, the forest was busy with troll folk. Over time, the males each went on a quest for glory. Each became lonely, slowly turned to stone. Okay. We saw them go, we could do nothing to help. Females remain, but their numbers fall too as the seasons pass. Oh dear. That is sad. I think I want this one. Sickness is spreading. That's forgotten about that. It's not indoors though, is it? Oh, it's very indoors. Ooh, this is worse than last time I was here. That's no good. That's no good at all. How's little Tom to doing? Hi there! I don't suppose you know where I might find the are. Tumta! He says. Thanks, tiny Tumta. This is Troll Holder's house. Hi there. I'm a friend of Troll Hilda. Any friend of Hilda's is welcome. What brings you to Hilda's little home? I'm looking for Wolfie Stick. Do you call it a Wolfie Stick? Yes, yes. Scared away ravens for a time. Stopped working. Too pretty. Threw it into the old pool. Okay, where's the old pool? It was important to you. I'll help you since I lost it. Come, troll friend Tove. Or possibly Tub. Uh. Oh! Okay, it's this way. Past this huge spiky pit. The most spiky forest pit. How do you cross it? Hulda, jump in! Having many spikes in hide is mark of troll might! <laughs> uh -huh. I don't want to be impaled though. Yes, 
Yes, you are mighty in spirit. <laughs> Flimsy in body like a pungent flower. Thanks, troll holder. <laughs> oh, okay, I thought I was going to have to chop that up. But no, I just get troll holder to do it for me. Thank you! Farewell, troll friend Toad. Okay, so this is the old pool. This is one of the pools that we were told to get, right? To get spring water from. We also need one that's corrupted. That's up by the poison temple. What is that amazing smell? I don't know. I can't smell it, you see. There seems to be a... A lot of jellyfish in these trees. Okay, it smells good. It's not the flies. A relaxing fragrance. Scare for the birds. Unlock the tree. Chop chop. Get out. Off to the rescue. What a terribly deep slumber. I heard from a mob of vicious ravens and must have dozed off. Things certainly seem smaller around here. I think it may have been more than a little nap. How long has he been sleeping for then? Right, we have lost touch. Okay, we are, we are we are regaining touch. Marvelous. More fast travel for us. More happiness for the trees. Connected once more. Thank you for waking me, child. Our routeways are yours to use. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Then. New badge unlocked. Connected. That's a blue badge. Open all of the routeways. Uh, a blue badge means that I get to park in disabled spaces. Can I save? No. Okay, apparently not. Okay. We have a pond. We have a lovely carved pendant for the journal. Beautiful spring water pond. It looks really deep. Can I grab water? No, okay. A little cave over here. Oh, looks really deep. I think it might be connected to the pond outside. Okay, can I use this one on this? Yep, like that. Okay. Bones! Oh yeah, we got some bones. Uh, clump of animal fur. Okay from whoever ate the things that used to be attached to those bones, I guess. Good, wonderful. Can I use the bone to make a torch, I wonder? What's that? Oh, oh, okay, the thirsty stones. Oh, okay, I didn't realize that, that I didn't realize I had those. Okay, let's see what happens if I dip this in here. Soaked up loads of water. It's glowing. This must be the spring that Foscrim mentioned. It's not small, it doesn't look tainted. I wonder what this tragic secret could be. Well, it might be something to do with the smell and also that thing. 
on the left that looks like the tail of a snake. It's making me feel super drowsy. Oh, I wonder if someone went swimming and they fell asleep. These eyes look so familiar. Maybe they're the supper lilies. Ah. Uh oh. That was a yeah. Oh, it's a knockin' tentacle. Hello. Hi there. Uh, what is that? It's bad news. Oh my god. Okay. And here we are, back in this place. It's working, this boy is special somehow. So that's our, that's Lars, that's our brother here. He's who we're here to try and rescue. And on the right, that's the cute little fuzzy monster that stole him, called Roki. Hello. And that lady is one of the four guardians. She's the Raven Guardian. Alright, demands more of my power. We must continue. I'm sorry this hurts you. Aww, that. It hurts me too. It's the only way to give you the life you deserve. It's my fault you are this way. Yes, yeah, so. Her child, Roki, is like half guardian, half human, I think? I don't know why it looks like that, though. My fault, you are feared. Chunt. Oh, like, she does that with her neck, which I don't like. The humans accept only their own. This way, you'll walk among them. Oh, okay, I see. She's gonna, like, transfer him into the kid's body or something. You'll never be burdened as I was. No matter the cost to me or anyone else. <sighs> Poor Lars. <laughs> something unexpected, something wonderful. Oh, stop doing that! Just turn around normally, woman! Do not fight it. Rawr. The last time we were here, Lars had a little sort of mini bonding moment with Roki. So maybe if we do that, he won't want to eat our brother. <laughs> okay. Core! Knockum, a tragic creature to bring a tragic end. Now she joins its sunken treasures. Core! The staff? How could she know about that? Well, it was kind of obvious, honestly. Like, there was one there, we knew we needed another one. The trolls, and yet the girl survives. She seeks her brother. Game over, says Boom Boom. I'm assuming not. But stranger things have happened. Tell's coming, she's going to take me home. She's been eaten by a giant tentacle monster. Coming boy. Destiny lies here with us. Shall not fail this time. Oh, yes, yeah, so they've been kidnapping children for like hundreds of years. And I think basically just trying the same thing every time. So, uh, she's not super bright. Oh. Uh huh. And she nearly just stabbed everyone with ice. Rawr. <laughs> right has never gotten this far before. You've like not done anything. <laughs> I was unprepared for the toll on my body. Well, it's probably because you keep snapping your head around while leaving the rest of it in place, isn't it? That's gonna be taking quite a toll on your body, idiot. Oh, she's bleeding from her nose. She's got like a an aneurysm or something. I will sniff. Rest a while. Oh, poor Mars. You okay? Oh, 
see he's ha he's making a friend. What's wrong with your hat? Uh, well, someone set it on fire. <laughs> and killed your dad at the same time. Once. Oh, he's got. Did he get a splinter of ice in it when she did that? She's a bad mom! Uh oh, growl. Icy splinter. My sister always pulls this out. How often do you get icy splinters, child? I've never got an icy splinter. Now, admittedly, I don't live in generic fellow Scandinavia country, but... There we go. Yoinked. See, you're so better now. I fixed it for you. Da -da -da. Making friends with the thing that's eventually going to inhabit your body and steal your soul. Yeah, you don't look so good actually. Your skin looks like it's turning like a deeper kind of greyish colour. It's not it's not great news. What's going to happen to me? Uh Have you ever seen Dishonored? Specifically Dishonored 2. Is that like no, no, not Dishonored 2. Um the solid knife of Donald, because because it's that basically is what's going to happen to you, child. <laughs> oh, I thought so. Irma? No, I don't have a mama, and I don't know what she was like. But I do have a big sister. She'll find me. She always does. Uh-oh. Haha. <laughs> Rurka heard me. You may be a little solace, but you are clearly special. You have lasted far longer than the others. Oh good. Wonderful. <laughs> she just keeps like kidnapping children and burning them out. God almighty, this woman. Your life is a great gift to us. Thanks. But it is as it has to be. We must feed the darkness to continue the right. What power remains in me flow through me now. Oh, now she's doing some more global magic. So basically, if Lars wasn't special, he would like already be dead and we would have totally failed in our quest. Oh, hello. Uh This uh this doesn't look like a wonderful thing. Oh, I'm alive. I also can't believe it. Boomo can't believe it, Boomo thought it was gonna be game over. Tie that put one in, in one piece. <laughs> Okay. Uh right. Ah, okay, completely. Yes. Okay. Luckily, tentacles are really bad at tying knots. Right, I now have my inventory. <gasps> it's the puppy stick. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can't get to it. I picked up a teddy bear? That's not good, in and of itself, to be honest. Mm -hmm. yeah, I dread to think who that used to belong to. Okay. Right, I can't swim across while the knock is there. It looks kind of lonely now. 
me to kid that to you. <laughs> Pass while this tentacle's here. Well, I guess, if in doubt. Okay, yeah, if I could hurt it, I saw a lot more tentacles on the thing. Okay. Can I throw the bow? I dropped your toy in the water. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Am I allowed to move during that little animation? Fantastic. Okay. Well, I need to find a way out of here, but I do also need to find the puppy dog stick. Oh. Are these? Did these used to be people? I hope you're just a statue. I don't think they are. I think they used to be people. Okay. Apparently, this is just a doll. Apparently we're going to dress up this this dead child. I'm gonna grab a box of lead shot. <laughs> and we're gonna grab some boots, tiny wellies. A little red bowl. I'm not sure how that helps us. This looks like a lobster pot. And that's blue fabric, apparently. Okay. So I guess we're going to dress the child up to be like a, a decoy. Huh? How did you get down here? Oh. Ah, the way out! <laughs> oh, okay, I see. I guess it doesn't want me to wander off. Hmm, interesting. It's tapping at those. This thinks he's been joining the tea party. Oh, okay, I see, it's a tea party. <laughs> Your weird little doll toes. 
Do I add the bowl as a hat? There we go. This should do it. It's fantastic. Right. You think I'm its pet? I mean, there are worse things in the world than being kept as the pet of a giant tentacle monster. Um, maybe you can play with doll me now. I need to go save my brother. Okay, the creature is distracted. Fantastic. Uh, but what about the puppy stick? New badge unlocked! Run away! Do do do! Gonna get out here. What about the puppy stick? I need the puppy stick. Oh! Hello! Why a girl went through knock knock and door? It bangs its long arms on Hilda's cave sometimes. Hilda knows better than go that way. Ha! <laughs> It had tentacles. Knock them. Oh, and there was also some water that we've just, I guess, drained down into the into the guy's lair. <laughs> Not kind like troll brother. Not beautiful like troll sisters. Not troll like at all. Okay. You're not wise enough to keep away. Not wise enough to know how to keep it away. Knock and pulls everything underwater. Troll cave without fire. Sucky feet. Poor cold Hilda. Best not touch it, it'll turn my gloves black. The tea is getting cold. Uh oh. She gonna eat us! One match left! Okay. Smell better to Hilda. It will soon. Okay. Hey, Hilda. Is this your cave? Yes, we know this. Best smelling, messy, soggy. Peaceful when humans not here. Okay, you won't splash stones in my lovely stream. And you're playing a flute. Hilda learning troll song. About lost stone troll brothers. Can I try it? My brother is lost too. Troll flute only for trolls. That's fair. To be fair, I don't think I could play that with my nose anyway. <laughs> Alright. I wonder if this is the, the used to be a big thing. Yes, yes it is. Just a quick dip in the water. Another satisfied stone. Alright, and we know we have the corrupted pool outside the poison place. So let's go. Three happy stones. Marvelous. Okay, let's head back. Because I think we now have all the ingredients for the tea. I think? Wait, was the, the thing for the tea? Controls for this are a little funky. I won't lie. Uh, broken 
health, but touch. Wolfrens. Uh looks like I need to find a way across a big gap where a bridge should be. Okay. I need to bring the instrument and offering of food. Oh, I need an instrument. Okay. Not peaceful, I was grabbed by a knocker. Okay. Uh, these plants will let me go anywhere. They have a mind of their own. Cave of potions. Yeah, I haven't found any of those yet. And something, something tea. Oh yeah, there's this troll over here who's, who's in stone. Okay, maybe I need to speak to the uh, the wise tree. I'm stuck. Can't go that way. There's a little tomto down in the basement. My little tonters in chat. Just went through great trials and tribulations after finding the supper lily. Grind them for five minutes. <laughs> okay, smells so soothing, just needs hot water. Well, I know who has hot water. Oh, hang on, I need to. What is it I need for you? Decoy. I'll be suffering another dusting soon. Uh, I don't think I found anything that would make a good decoy. No, nothing here looks like a a, a decoy crackling. Your wisest tree, please. Unless I can speak to you. No, I can't speak to you. What's happened to you, child? We see water. Yes. <laughs> From a <laughs> yeah, yeah. I got I got into a tiny weeny tiny little puddle of water. You escaped it, that was well done. Such things are best left alone. <laughs> Okay, I have to go back and have something I need. Do you know how I fight it? You don't. You can be a captive or it's liberator. Okay. Mm -hmm. Must find its true name. Every syllable must be said to it. Speak falsely and it will only get stronger. Okay, do you know its name? No. The knock is not like its sibling. Huh? Oh, I see! Okay, I guess that sort of makes sense. They both have lots of limbs, at least. Mm. Ah, clever. It was of the land... It was off the land before being lost to the water. Okay. Ah, mm. uh, they are the saddest of creatures. <laughs> its pain and loss made it what it is. It was not always of the water, it was of the land. Oh. Can't now recall it was ever young playful. Okay, do you mean they drowned? Oh. I mean, it's, it's a place of tragedy and it likes tea parties and teddy bears. <laughs> Aww. Okay. Right. Uh, let's go to Troll Hilda's cave. Make some tea so she doesn't eat us.
it's sleeping tea, isn't it? So maybe it'll make her go to sleep and we can pinch her flute? I don't particularly want to steal her flute, but uh... Needs must, as they say. Right, this looks decidedly more like drugs than it actually is. Uh... Okay, then all the other troll sisters? There's what tastes like slug tea. He'll write a new song for it. Okie doke. Tell him not drinking any? No thanks. Special troll tea only for trolls. Okay. Tell of kind human and her bones. Oh, okay. Put her to sleep. Sorry, Hilda. Have a rest now and don't eat anyone. Yeah, I suppose we are stealing the flute from someone who's not very nice and does eat people. Okay. I was worried we'd sort of start this and I wouldn't know where to go, and like I wouldn't... I wouldn't know how to solve any puzzles. But uh, we've actually made fairly good progress, which I'm happy about. Back into the tree of wisdom. Hi! <laughs> what glitters and rhymes with cold? And is surprisingly stinky. Did you find some troll gold? I did, then I threw it into the mill pond. Thought it might be a wishing well. But I found a croaker instead. Who's gonna eat me like everything in this blooming forest? Used to be home to a kindly water sprite. Okay. She was a good friend to the waitries. How to ensure our roots always had fresh water. Until old Mama Croak moved in. Now she is lost, perhaps forever. That croak is not a friend to our kind. Okay. Good to know. Thanks for the lore. Uh, I think it's this one I want to get to the wolf place. Yes. Let's go find Fossagram. I was also very worried about like not finding all of the flowers. I was worried they'd be too well hidden. You have water on you. Whose ball did you enter while resisting mine? Don't know, didn't get much choice. Didn't you say you had a sibling who would pull me under? That was them. How do I stop them? Do not speak her name. Okay. She has the stick. The puppy stick. She was not born of water, was trapped there in her sadness. Okay. She has forgotten and has been forgotten. If you wish me to begin your teaching, child, I must first satisfy all three thirty stones. Determine the chosen instrument and Oh, I forgot the offering. I forgot the offering. Oh! I wonder... So she's a child that drowned. Maybe I need to read the names from the... The parish book? To her? Or maybe she's one of the names on the gravestone, possibly? Hmm. Okay, we'll go back to the, uh, the bell place. Mm. 
Markson girl was lost to the watery depths. Oh, you'll have some Marcus. Uh, can I use the book? Halgen Jensen. Ah, you'll have some Marcus. The poor drowned daughter she was. Ignis Olaf. You'll have some Marcus. Okay. Have I got now, now like, notes? Yes, there we go. Fantastic. Just check there's nothing I need to do in here. Oh, I can't read the stones again. Ah, oh, yes. Hang on, I've got a trowel. I forgot that was here. What the hell's the stone disc one then? But it's not, I thought originally it was for sharpening my, uh, my dagger, but I sharpened that ages ago. Hmm? Patterned disc. We're finding a lot of weird stuff today. We found this weird box. We found a lobster pot. And we found a patterned disc with glowing jewels. I wonder if it goes here. I don't know why it would go here. <laughs> no, okay. Hmm. Can I hit this with a hammer? <laughs> yes! Apparently I can! <laughs> okay. I'm now also carrying around a horse's head statue, but I don't know why. <laughs> okay, sure, sure. Why not? Oh, hang on, wait, there's a tree here. I want the tree. Do -do -do. Who walks anywhere when you can do tree travel? I can't believe I came back. That was no fun at all. Is there anything else over here? I never actually explored further this way. Okay, no, there isn't anything else over here. Right. Uh oh. Hello! Oh, I have to wait for you to. Oh no, I don't have to wait for you to put me in. Oh, never mind. So, you're a tortured soul. Never had a chance to grow up. Okay. Can't let you stop me, so I'm sorry. Ignis, Olaf, Yolhafsen, Markusen. Fingers crossed. Nick, Nick, Nick. I hope we got the right name. Better luck next life. Jesus. The lake froze over. Okay. You alright there, Boom Boom? That was quite creepy. Uh, I won't lie. Alright, I guess we're going in here. Maybe I can find a way to move this water. Probably having the same spring. Oh. Oh, that means I need to find the food. I defeated the monster, but I have I need the I need the the offering. The horrors. It was a little it was a little heavy on horrors, I won't lie. Where can I find food? Get on that log, Telf. Hmm. 
Oh, the cat has food. Wait, hang on, the cat needs to be black, and I found black sludge in Hilda's cave, right? Hang on, hang on, hang on. I forgot about the cat. I actually, the, uh, the, the mother might be a better teleport point for Troll Holder's Cottage than the place I was teleporting to. <laughs> About the portal. You should know where your brother is. We have not, but we know where he is. Okay. Utengard, the nether to this world's ether. Uh huh. It's not a place humans are meant to be. Oh, boss. It's not bad or good, but it's not meant for us. We do not envy you this task, child. We'll be here to advise if you need us. Thanks, Tree. You are full of helpful wisdom. Black and she sludge. Don't want to just leave these rounds lying around. Okay, can I go scoop it in a jar? Yes, there we go. A portable mess of black sludge. Oh, yeah, we're gonna smear this all over that cat. He's gonna be so happy, you have no idea. <laughs> the guardians do before they were lost? They gathered the four seasons, the four winds. The dawn, day, twilight, and dark. Right, okay. The balance was their power. Three guardians were in this realm. Okay. I observed there were four, but Rurka left them. Without her, balance was lost, and they were lost in turn. Why did she leave? Uh, the raven is never satisfied with what it has. Oh, that's okay. This is an interesting... Different story to what we saw before. Uh. Yep. The ravens. Boop. Okay. Let's go... Give the kitty cat some black sludge, some hair dye. To hide the fact that it's, it's getting old. Kitty cat, I found some some hair dye for you. It's a revitalizing pomade with active charcoal. <laughs> Rub it on your fur; it'll make you black and healthy. Oh wow, that was quick. This sounds pleasing to you, like go by bloody hell, you like you like Kurtin. I must see this pomade witchcraft for myself. Drink your food. Oh, I see he's looking in the mirror. Ah, right. Okay, now we have everything we need for Foster Grandma. Marvelous. I can't believe we've changed from helping everyone to just our nicking stuff from everyone. <laughs> I 
I still haven't figured out how to free the Kirklings yet, but I'm sure that will come. Uh, this one. Do, do, do. I still haven't found a torch for that cave. No longer got to sense my sister in the water. <sighs> so, your sister drowned. What happened to you? Were you a real person once? Who? What What happened to you to turn you into a six-armed, beady weedy guy? <sighs> Do you remember who she is now? And is remembered. Thank you. Fantastic. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we did that. Okay. Alright, hang on. Uh, can I give you the, the stones? One of the thirsty stones has been quenched. I see you have more to give me. Oh, God. So I have to do these one at a time. Do thirsty stones! Three thirsty stones. The last thirsty stones. What else do you bring? I bring food. An absolutely ginormous ham. <laughs> What's an impressive ham? Stolen from a powerful being. Utterly delightful. This is fine payment. Right. Now I think I just need to give you the flute, right? This flute looks like it's made of bone, doesn't it? Let's not think about that! Let's not think about that! A simple instrument built with a ple pleasant tone. Is that everything? Can you teach me to command water? I wish Lars could see this! Water into the flute. Crude it may be, but now there is no finer flute. And no finer player. Be careful, water is not always nice. Thank you, Felsagram. Oh, okay, that's, that's we don't need to have this conversation again. New badge unlocked, though, such a charmer. Oh, yeah. Okay. One of the two quests completed, and we still haven't even really started on the other one. <laughs> right. I still don't have. Oh, for goodness sake, this is going to be the torch then. Ah! Oh, I could have sworn I already tried that. Hang on a sec. I've knocked my headphones loose. Now I'm not hearing anything in the left ear. Oh, okay, there we go. Right! Well, we've just learned how to command water, but instead we're going to go into this cave. <laughs> I thought this is the only dark cave that we refuse to go in. Find that one I'm up against. Terrifying beast, some mystic creature. It's another disc. Interesting. Very interesting. It's interesting because we don't know what they're for yet. But here we have the first of the things for the other recipe, a ram skull. 
I need to think of the bird that caught this. Oh yeah. We, we still need the the nat um, nam, nata namata. We still need the parasites. Uh, wait, hang on. Okay. I wonder if I can get there with the water blue as well. Doors. I actually I haven't read these in great detail, but the bits I have, they're, they're quite endearingly written. This is like a tree with eyes. <laughs> this is cute. I need to read these two at some point actually. Um, what am I looking for? For the church, wolf ruins, plateau, lost grim, siren. Poison forest, cave of potions, two Natamere parasites. I don't even have one Natamere parasite yet. And I found the the wolf place and the stag place. I haven't found the other place, which I think is bear possibly. Flies. Okay. <laughs> That's cute. Water, it's gone. <gasps> Where did the water go? <laughs> oh, okay. Uh interesting. Only this bit of the water left. I see, of course. Move this much water? I don't know. <laughs> this is pretty mental. The flute, it's cold. I think the enchantment is gone. Oh. Well, I guess I won't be able to flip my way over to, uh... Oh, oh dear, we've, uh, we've killed all of these fish. Whoopsies! Can I pick one of them up? We keep needing food in this game. I'm sure we'll need fish at some point. Okay, here we are. Let's check if there's anything else on the ground here before I go up. That wall is the way out. I want this wall as the way up to the puppy dog stick. Mm. Hooray! God, all of that just to progress like <laughs> 10 meters in the wolf temple. I feel like I got a rum deal off of Foster Grimm there. Here's a, here's a water controlling flute. Surprise, it only lasts for two uses. Split. That was a bit too close, yeah. Yeah, it was. Jesus. And now 
crawl back into Hilda's cave. You're not closing behind me again. Can I give her the flute book? Now that it's no longer magical. No, apparently not. That's not allowed. That's a shame, because if I did, she'd never know it was missing. Uh, no, double check. Right, and we have that horse head and two wheels still, but I'm not sure what they're for. Hi tree! Always questions. Yes, I was wondering. Can you see my house? You are not of the forest. Our sight begins and ends at the forest edge. You may have seen my papa? Big beard, bigger belly, red shirt, on fire. No, okay. Well, he was meant at the forest with bellies of any size. <laughs> Will you watch for him? Watch for a big bellied Tove Papa. Thanks, Tree. Wolf. Right. Puppy statue. get up here when the puzzles weren't solved the, in order to like steal this stick in the first place Looks like there's a lot more Wolf Temple path to go. Uh... Oh! That's a big boy! That's a big boy! What an amazing place! What an amazing dog! Feels like no one's been here for a long time. No kid. Okie doke! It's a puppy! Is his favorite. Yes. Made it. It's really there, the wolf. So that's what the guy looks like. He's got a. Uh, he's got lots of stuff going on. That is a big boy, Boom Boom. You're not wrong. Right. Puppy is covered in goop, parasites, and all sorts of things. That fungus looks horrible. Maybe that's the- oh! Can I give that a yoink? No, I guess not. Can I see something loud? Well, if only there was like a convenient horn nearby. I saw the breath after that climb. Okay, look. Wow, she blew so hard her feet came off the floor. Mm. It's not working. What if I can't wake her? That would be bad. Okay. Okay, it's gonna work. Please work. Oh, Pat. Oh, there we go. Hello. Hi there, puppy. <laughs> woohoo! Don't woohoo just yet, Tav. The last time you met something that was even closely related to one of these things, they destroyed your entire house and stole your brother. Okay. Yurtanolfa. Traitor? Mm. Come closer so I may tell you wing from wing. Uh. I don't have wings? Where is she? 
Child, I see that. Where is the traitorous raven? I mean, if the story is true, it's not really her fault that she's cross with you for... Like, all she did was have a kid. Like, yes, she is separately evil. <laughs> I will hunt her down. I can't seem to move. What is happening to me? New badge! Wolf Waker! Hey there, puppy friend. I'm Tub. Or sometimes Toad. I think you're sick. Why does a human girl cub pretend, presume to tell me how I am? Oh my god. They're, are they all gonna be horrible people? You must feel it on your snout and all over you. I think it's a Natomir parasite. A small creature of chaos in Snare Yurton? My snout! The pain! You'd let me, I can try and remove it. Mm. Just a tiny human cub, I can't hurt you. Ooh, very clever tough. If you try, I could consume you in one bite. <gasps> nice people, this. Gods do be like that, says Boom Boom. Oh, great. Okay. You're brave for a human. Yeah, I'm not sure which category these guardians technically fall into. Okay, I think I could pull it out. If it hurts, please don't eat me. I think I got it. Oh! Uh... Well! That was a surprise. How do they get back here? An excellent question. Papa? Papa! Oh my god, he's actually awake! He's awoken from his drunken stupor. For the first time in forever. You can't hear me. Am I a ghost? Uh, I'm gonna have a pause just for a drink quickly. Excuse me, right. Let's see what's up with Ghost Dad. He looks so sad. Oh, I know what day this is. Oh no, is this the day our mum fell down the well? No, okay, he threw mum's stuff down the well, okay. I'm not sure I'll ever forgive him. Why'd I be back here? A good question. Now we had the safety rope. I still worry about little Lars falling in. To be fair, it's not a very good safety rope. Oh! Now it's a much worse safety rope! So congrats on that one, Tuv! Uh, we have dream rope. Do I have the rest of my inventory with me? No, I don't. Okay. This is this is dream only inventory. Which means I won't be taking this rope out into the real world with me, I'm guessing. Which is probably for the best. I don't know that I should trust Ghost Rope to hold me up. There's nothing else around that I can interact with. Well, I can't interact with Papa either. I can go down here. Okay. Uh. Well, I didn't expect that. I'm now tiny. Maybe I can climb back in the bucket. Rip. Okay. Yes, Tub, those are hands. I've got Mama's locket. So we've got some sort of a, a floating thing there. A giant eyeliner pencil. I think it's actually a normal eyeliner pencil, to be honest. Okay, I've got to find a way out of this well, away from the hands. Okay, apparently I, I need to not 
not get looked. Oh. Get grabbed even. Okay. Looks like her hairbrush. Okay. We can punt. And if the bottom gets Oh, hello! Oh! I've got 3D punting. I was expecting like scripted punting. That looks like the way out. That's so maybe let's go there last. I don't like the sort of the janky move. Okay, can't actually get off to look at that picture. Birthday with a kitty cat. Mama baked me. Oh my god, a princess torta. A, a princess tart or cake, maybe. And we got Stoker, kitty cat. It was a perfect day. I was so happy. Aww. Oh. <laughs> I feel like I'm right back there, she says. And then she is. I was a bit more money getting this ready. Papa burst in with my presence and a big grin on his face. Now, isn't that relationship dynamics in a in a single sentence? <laughs> my happy times were happy. My birthday is on the seventeenth of no month. Got a straw. I thought we were taking the whole cat for a second, to be honest. Okay. Another straw. I hate it when they say exactly what I say for baiting. How rude of them. Ring biscuits. Or party rings. Yeah, okay. A camera? Ah. Okay, I see. Right. Is this some Natomir parasite induced haze? Oh. Okay. I'm back up top again. This is getting a little trippy and confusing. Is that me? Hi there, me. I'm so little, like Lars. Well, you're not quite that little. The box, the snow. It's not right, it's not how I remember. Okay. Well, that was weird. Back here. Okay. I've got the box again. I was really fascinated by that box. What was I packing away? Mama stuff. I don't remember this. Interesting. Okay. So we're having memories about Mum's things were remembering that I threw them away, even though I didn't and our dad did. I wonder if I can like a rip up? No, okay. Can I make 
like something. Hmm. Okay, we'll come back to it. We'll come back to it. Yeah, they are a bit. They block it. This one's wearing rings. For sure, for sure. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I'm not allowed up there. That one likes rings, does it? No? Okay, I'm not supposed to give you rings, apparently. Hmm. That one has no taste. Really strict on matching accessories. Okay. Can I give it nail polish? No. I'm surprised that the ring didn't work on that. So we can go, it's over here. Well, there's a ring up there. And there's another hand in the way. Camping trip. Papa's favourite time of the year. Ooh. He even made his pickled herring sandwiches. <laughs> you know who's not in any of these memories? <laughs> Lars. Oh, I suppose Mummy might be pregnant. Here. I miss your big belly laughs and your big bear hugs. Mm. Look at little me, all safe and happy. Mm. Probably impatient to explore. <laughs> okay. Mm. Well, last camper trip. Lars was almost here. I see. Mm. Yeah. I'll find him, Mama. I'll find Papa's burnt child remains as well. Mm. Locked for once. He must have been cleaning it. Bima says, wasn't it implied she died in childbirth? I actually can't remember how she died. Um <laughs> It's been it's been a whole week since I found out. Is there anything that goes with a fishing box? I don't think so. sure what I'm supposed to be doing with all these items. Apparently I used to make stuff out of straws. Can we go back here? Yeah, okay. If it's possible I've missed stuff along the way. I can go back for um, Okay, can I use this on these? Yes. That'll get one hand away. Oh, hang on, wait, there's more stuff. There's a ring up there. This one's tapping the ground. Dancing? I don't think so. <laughs> that was a pure guess. <laughs> I was like, well, that could be used as like an instrument. I see, okay. Oh. One of farmer's rings. Okay, so each of the hands can be placated by something. I can't, you know, 
get that. this hand's doing? Transfixed by the pencil earlier. Okay. Do you like straws? Straws are like pencils. This is more interesting than crushing me, promise. Okay. I need some kind of bridge. Just use my straws, haven't I? Oh. You like rings? Okay, you're kind of happy with anything. Together. Okay. I'm sure I tried to do that before, but maybe I only had the two straws. Okay. This gets me to here. My first fishing trip. I couldn't believe I caught something and he didn't. So long, since he developed a drinking habit, in fact. <laughs> we can all go next summer. Yeah, sure. Oh whoops, that's the uh that's the way out. <laughs> that's not what I'm here for. I don't know what I am here for. Papa's fishing box. He always kept it locked. Ah, okay, I have to go and look at the other fishing box to find the numbers, the open one. Ah, clever. Although I don't know what's going to be in the closed one that isn't in the open one. Okay. Let's just, uh... Open here. Oh no, it's something something oh five. But we don't know what the other numbers are. He was cleaning it. I don't think we have anything else. We only have half the numbers. Hmm. I wonder if the other numbers are gonna be like our mum's birthday or something. something sharp from the fishing box. I only have two numbers. Maybe they're going to be my birthday? Things I can look up here mm -hmm. on the calendar. Mm -hmm. 
17. Okay, let's try 1705. It's so cliche, people using, like, birthdays for passwords. I've never even been tempted to use a birthday as, like, a password. I've never understood that. Okay, My birthday! Papa. Oh, Papa. <laughs> going to hook. I don't know why we could have just going to hook from the open fishing chest in the other picture, but sure. <clears throat> Mima says, honestly, oh, it's a pretty good way of memorizing someone's birthday. That's a good point, actually, I suppose, because I never remember anyone's birthday ever. Grab that. Excuse me. I don't think I need it, but just in case. Okay, we used a load of items. Don't be found load of items, we used load of items. I can't reach. Able to climb with this, no. Or that. Okay. I keep thinking that if I hit escape, it'll uh, get past text. It doesn't. Right, I need to get up there somehow. Can I get these sticks back? Must be something else in a picture somewhere. Hmm. That's the way out. Something else. Why was our first fishing trip in a cave? What a weird place to go fishing! It's not this one. Get across this bridge tunnel, for goodness sake. Okay, we go to that gun. Uh 
that we have a chef skull. The chef skull says, was it, sim was it in a cave? Was the memory simply stored in a cave? Good point. The pictures seem to be in a fuel. I actually weirdly didn't pay attention to the picture, but you're right. The picture is definitely not of a cave. Hmm. Okay. I need resources. Oh yeah, look, they're all in caves. Uh, Shesko says, Happy Constitution Day for Norway. Congrats. I assume that's the day when you, like, got a new constitution, I suppose? Uh, congratulations. Also, Happy International Day Against uh, Homophobia, Biphobia, and Transphobia. Yeah, that one. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Okay, I don't think there's anything else I can steal from here. Oh wait, no wait, there's, I've got a button for, for seeing what's stealable, haven't I? Hang on. Uh, it's F, I think? I'm pretty sure it's just those two things. Nothing else is stealable in here. I totally forgot about that! <laughs> just because it was the day we got the constitution that would lead to our independence from Sweden. Oh, that's cool! Oh, he's got something in his. Ah, he's got a comb! Ah, there we go. Yes, of course. The comb becomes a ladder, which gets us up to the thing. Ah. For some reason, I the Hobbit has mostly forgotten in Norway. That is a shame, I guess. Oh, God, this is like the sparsest tooth comb I ever saw. <laughs> Okay, I see all of the little things stuck in everything of pins. Oh, I hadn't realised. Interestingly, that hand was already full of pins. Does that mean that I've been down here loads of times before? Hmm. Troubling. But I mean, this whole se segment has been troubling, to be honest. I'm not sure why Getting anatomy of parasite did this to me. <gasps> All right, what's in the locket? Nothing is in the locket. Okay. Here we go. Why? All right. Oh no, I don't want to remember. Was it actually me who threw all the stuff down the lake after all, and Dad's here to stop me? It's me. I'm emptying the box. Mama. All of Mama's things. <gasps> but it was Papa. No. Hmm. It wasn't. <laughs> Aww. Dad. Why did you do that? I was so angry. <laughs> you tried to give me them, and I said... I said I hated them. Papa. 
Papa. Help me, Papa. Let me blame him all this time. Him? Why would you do that? Because he has a drinking problem. He doesn't remember that it wasn't him. Ah. Uh, oh dear. And now you, and then you burnt him alive. Remember. What if I never see you again? Please, you have to be okay. You have to be. People always recover from third degree burns. Oh god, the trauma doesn't stop in this game, does it? I'm back, and the, uh, the anatomy of parasite still seems to be stuck in this puppy's face. Well, never mind. I tell a lie. Okay, I cured you somehow. You freed me, girl cub. I freed the parasite. I think I'll hold on to it. That's <laughs> I'm weak. The anatomy has showed me terrible things. <laughs> me too. I've had a lot of visions, but... Uh, the anatomy shows you chaos in your heart. You are fierce enough to face it in return. You have a fierce nature girl, perhaps beyond my own. Oh wow, that's high praise coming from you at Norfolk. I may never have escaped it without you. Great debt. What would you ask of a Yurta? Strength, secret knowledge, to see in darkness. Yes. I came here for <laughs> Lars. I came here for help my brother. We know that bit. And uh, what? Yes, what Boom Boom says. Uh, I, I wholeheartedly agree. Uh, yeah, Lars was taken to a portal by some kind of monster. I ask you to please open the portal for me. Portal was opened. Yes. I think Lars isn't the first child it's taken. Mm. No, I cannot, I will not. <sighs> she who dwells beyond the portal must have no way back inside. The ravens would cover the land in chaos. Mate, I don't know where you've been, but the land is already covered in both ravens and chaos. <sighs> there are ravens in chaos everywhere. The forest is out of balance. Woof, he says. Family, yes, it seems mine has failed. The forest suffers as you say, she must be strong. That thing she bore stronger still. Oh my god, you're such a racist! Jesus Christ! Um, Jessica says, did they literally just call it the giant wolf? Yep, that's its name. I think they're all called, like, the giant bear, the giant this, the giant raven, the giant the other thing. Uh... Jessica says, I'm a no mains when she or the toddler burns by the chicken nuggets were to blame. The blame for the ass of the Oh, I haven't heard of a toddler burned by chicken nuggets. Is that why they always arrive sort of medium lukewarm now? My sister. Another Yurton? Raven, Rurka, she betrayed us, betrayed her duty. Oh my god! She had a child! Like my siblings, the bear and the stag. Oh yeah, just like that. I can't do this alone. Thank you. I'll be with you soon, Lars. Okay. So, we are... We have one parasite and a ram skull, and we are no closer to uh, getting that crookling here, as far as I know. Oh my god, Cheskel, that's crazy! Uh oh. Well, bye! That's that then! I hope I see you soon. <laughs> it's like, nope, you can just go now. Alright. We're, we're one out of three. Uh, I don't know. Oh! God almighty. That's really bad news. Must be travelling through the route. Oh. Oh no. 
Hey, Mama Tree, you okay? You're a... Uh... Oh, I accidentally went through that one. Okay, so this is, this is how it got in. Now it's at Mama Tree. I guess soon it'll be at all the other trees. What is this infection? Okay, it's not at this one yet. Hey, Tree. Your mum's dying. She's got a... She's got fungal nail inf infection. Ah, hmm. uh, and it's killing her. She also says, apparently her policy of just superheating things, they would still be warm after a car ride, instead of investing in better packaging. So you need to just pay those who sued them to lose the profit margin. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Great. Fantastic. Huh? I think that the Guardians won't happen when I find them. Oh. Uh -huh. Need their strength, power, and wisdom. Mm -hmm. I know, and I need them to open the portal too, but... <gasps> Are they friendly? The one you just met threatened to eat you just for existing. <sighs> Will they be angry that I've disturbed them? Or worse, will they try to eat me? It's unlikely that you would satiate the hunger. Wow, thanks, Tree. Thanks, Tree. <laughs> um, okay. I'm gonna go back to the house, see if there's anything I can dig up with my trowel. I assume I still have my trowel, right? Oh, but the the order of my inventory has been changed. Oh, and I still have the empty jar. Interesting. Oh, the sickness is here too. Oh, that's no good. Oh, that's no good. Alright, we already dug up that wheel, and we used the hammer to get down the statue. What are they for? Shuska says, Stavkirka. Yes, yes, I suppose it must be. The, the fancy churches that you showed me before. I hadn't told that it was one of them, but it is a fancy church. And there's still these. The, uh, the the graves that all have the same numbers in different orders and have different symbols on them. I don't know what that's a puzzle for still. I confirm that we're in Norway or Poland. Okay, I'm glad that we, we, we've got a, a final decision on that. Can we go in any of these places? Not strong enough to crack it open more. I'm assuming I can't dig it open. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, I stop it! Game. For sake. It doesn't have a baroque roof, so we're in the way. <laughs> Can I drop something on it? From up here? Can I cut the bell now? That would be crazy. It might just work though. Like we're playing Hitman. <laughs> gently now! Gently? How do you gently cut down a bell that weighs like five times as much as you do? Oh Jesus. <laughs> Sorry, Belle, you won't get to ring again. Well, you'll get to ring again exactly once. This is wanton vandalism. Yes. <laughs> Crazy. New achievement, or new badge, Bell Ringer. I wish they installed the slide. Right, okay, we've now got a hole in the floor. The bell just went straight through. 
So Dark has to be brave. Ah! I guess this is where the bear lives. The crypt. I thought they were just in stories. Why would they just be in stories? Oh, yeah, there's lots of places around here to explore. Uh, ah! Look, here's where the puzzle is! I wonder what these symbols mean. Cube shaped indent. Hmm. Oh, okay. Right, so that's a moon. Can I take them out? Yes. Okay, so that's where the mysterious stone that I found before comes in handy. That's a six, and I've now got myself a three and a two. I need to find a one somewhere. Go left. Okay, this one's covered with spider webs. Something's behind it. Wow, if only I had something that could cut through spider webs. This dagger is by far and away the most useful thing I've found so far, and it's not even a combat game. <laughs> That's what says the square hole can fit any shape. Oh no. Oh no. I was traumatized by that video. Okay. Ah! A stone block with something carved on it. Wonderful. Oh, is this a carrot? It's a Tomta hat! Wait, there are Tomta graves down here as well? Make a nice dish to the journal. Wait, don't they like live inside their hats? This is that's basically like a dead Tomto, right? That's what we found. Okay, what's on this side? Who yeah, were these people? They were large, is what they were. Look how big these graves are. Oh, another disc. We've got three discs now. Interesting. I was sort of wondering if we were going to take the, the discs and the horse head and make like a little Trojan horse mobile. <laughs> Just says, some of the facts. The reason Norway is one of the only places in the world with wooden churches is because building with rocks was wildly impractical in mountains. Was it? I would have sort of thought that you'd have easier access to building rocks in mountains. So I have no idea how this stave church has a stone basement. <laughs> ah, okay. Uh, moon. Am I gonna have to remember all of these? Do I need to get out a little notepad document? Hang on. <laughs> Hang on, I'm opening notepad. Right, moon is one six two three. Star one three two six The Sun, also known as a circle to you and me, is one two six three. Unknown symbol, hang on, is one, two, three, six. Fantastic. So there are a few combinations there that we didn't have. Because um, we could have had like one, six, three, two, and one, three, six, two. Then no one died in those years, I guess. 
uh, Shasko says they were hard to transfer up and down hills. Not all rock is ideal for building with, and either rock may not be in ideal locations to build. I suppose that's true. Right. Okay. So, moon is one, six. Customer ID inventory. Three is the end. Two is second from end. And one is, of course, at the front. Because no one has yet died in the year 6132. <laughs> Secret code, oh yeah. Shaskal says building with stone would quite literally be Sisyphean. <laughs> these are these guardians, they like their puzzles, don't they? Big fans of puzzles. Oh, hello. Oh, it's another one of these things. The night sky, and there is a fourth wheel. Oh no. No, wait, it's fine. I found the fourth wheel's already here. Huh. Okay. Right. So, that one, it's easy enough to figure out it goes at the end. This one only has one entrance, so that goes at the head. Which leaves. Well, this one must go here because it's got four outputs. So, uh, go. That one goes there. Oh yeah, we like solved the puzzle before we even found it practically. Oh! Ah! Oh, I guess I didn't get to uh, see where any of the other stairs and stuff go. Rip. Okay, it's a lift fight level. Your enemies are going to drop down and the lift will only land once you beat them. Probably. Okay, this is the bear cave. Who good at the game skill issue. Can I go back up? Nope. Lol, stuck here forever. There's lots of spider webs. I'm quite concerned about the proliferation of spider webs. Oh, there's also little glowy nipples. Interesting. They're moving. The time from from finding one guardian to finding the next is a lot shorter than I would thought it would be. <laughs> Deserted, not even one combo broken. And we found a big cuddly warm friend. Hi there, big cuddly warm friend. A giant bear. A Yurton Bjorn. The guardian. <laughs> Hi there, can you uh, can you send your lift back up please? I sort of forgot to uh to look at something. Definitely <laughs> giant definitely sleeping. There's weird stuff growing all over here. And another anatomy of parasite. So I can't reach because his paws in the way. So we're going to wake him up and have him eat us. Obviously the solution. <clears throat> Not getting closer until it's cleaned up. Fine. Okay. Chop chop. I love the little the, the, the noise. <clears throat> Gosh, my throat's a bit wrecked, so I'm gonna mute while I do the cutscene so I can have a drink. Hmm, 
we seem somehow to have uh, managed to not only not wake the bear, but to accidentally wake what sounds like bats, but probably will be all the spiders. <clears throat> Good job, us. Good job, us. Is that you, Bear Guardian? It's not. You should not have come here. You should have run! You've been watched every step and you'll go no further. Watched by who? The trees? Yeah, that sound like the trees. <laughs> it's spiders! Not afraid. Oh! Honestly, I thought you'd be bigger. You are called Widow Drow. I know your name, Tov. I don't know how to pronounce it, though. Don't usually eat human children. Troll food! Wow! Thanks. Thanks, Spider. Thanks. <clears throat> the ravens threaten to eat my children. They insist you be an exception. Uh oh. Well, I've been eaten. Okay, now it's game over, boom boom. You know, I'm phenomenally. It keeps happening that I think I'm about to be eaten by something, and we cut to this place. And I never end up being eaten. So close. Uh. Oh! Oh! I see! He's not being turned. He's not possessing Lars, he's just being turned into Lars. I see. I thought he looked smaller last time. He's got piles and piles of fruit to keep him healthy. <laughs> He's adorable. I was unprepared for how this transformation would tire us so. You really should wipe up that, like, black blood. Oh, hello, he speaks. Eat. Please, you must do this for me. Oh, good. He's pulling out all the stops in child manipulation. She still doesn't feel how to turn around. And here comes the bird. The bird, having previously told her that I'm about to be eaten by the knocker, is now here to tell her that I'm about to be eaten by the spider. Core. She met our little friend. She made it further than I would expect. Core. Better this way. My traitorous yet my siblings would never have helped her. Uh, you say that. They don't help those who are different. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No matter their needs or pet. Poor Rogi. Too proud, too angry, too fearful. The word you're looking for is racist, still. Um, the forest is a better place without them. It's just a, basically, this game is like a bunch of people all being really horrible, really horrible dicks. Um, and you have to sort of solve all the problems that are caused by this. I'm glad I infected this other sort of Okay, so she, surprise, surprise, put the anatomy of parasites in. Eternity of nightmares is fair punishment for what they did to us. <coughs> Poor Lars. Tough. Wait, does he pronounce it Tuve? Should I have been saying it Tuve this whole time? My oh, sympathy, she was an intriguing girl. Oh, I'm sure that makes him feel so much better, Erka. So much better. Did she know her brother was touched by magic? She didn't, but I did out of character. Oh, he's only got one welly on. I suppose that's so that she can put the manacle on him. <laughs> Otherwise it won't work, will it? So many have been in your place, yet none have been worthy. 
You are different. You are how we save my rookie. Poor Lars, he's got more coughing than dialogue now. Am I playing as Lars? I think I'm playing as as Rurky at this point. Bop, have some noms. Om nom. Yes, more noms. Give me more noms, give me more noms. You know, if the problem is that the children haven't been strong enough to get this far, and one of the reasons why Lars is dying is because he's, he needs food to keep his strength up, I feel like she could have solved this problem a long time ago. Just feed the children instead of starving them. Oh, hello. Rocky speaks now. He, he can nearly say our name. <laughs> I don't know how many times I'm going to have to hit the enter button to give Lars food. Uh, it might be quite a lot. Uh oh. I think Mummy noticed. Do not make this harder than it needs to be. If you don't know if this is the only way you'll be accepted. Human father, my yet my brothers and sisters, they all abandoned us. All I wanted was a family. Oh, he doesn't want to change. Yeah. If there was another way, yeah, yeah. We've heard it all before, from villains with better control of their necks than you. Boop. Oh, she straight up just uh, smushed that out of existence, didn't she? <laughs> we must complete the rites while we have strength. Oh, now she's bleeding from her eyes! Good, good. Once again, I seem to be not very mm. although I think I've lost my hat if I had one. I also seem to be hung up next to Perry the Platypus. Uh, where am I? I'm in the Crystal Kingdom of the Tomta. That's not where I expected to be. I was going to say it's tough as doing a Luke. Oh yeah, there's the sword over there. I'm gonna have to force pull it to me, aren't I? If you mean your predicament, the spider. Yes, you are hers now, with all us cave tomta. Oh, okay. That's a hat, is it? I thought that was a beak sticking out there. I thought you were some sort of crazy duck creature, but apparently not. She feasts on us as we once fed on treasure. Oh my god. Well, that's horrifying. Wait, I have a dagger? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the, the spider searched your, your possessions and, and took the sharp ones from you. She's lived for millennia and not by chance. Jesus, how many toms has she eaten in that time? That's horrifying! Why does everybody in this bloody forest eat sentient things? Can't anyone eat mushrooms? Or like pigs? Actually no, the cat eats pigs. The cat does also eat people, but the cat eats pigs too. Um... Jessica <laughs> says, Platypus is being Australian Tom Tom would explain a lot. <laughs> oh dear. I've tried so hard, I've got so far, and in the end, oh. it didn't even matter. Lars. Poor Lars. He's Lars. gonna 
I'm not actually sure what's happening to Lars. If he's not being possessed, I'm not sure why he's getting sicker. Tiny Tom to Lars, all alone with that thing. <laughs> oh, Pat. There's this Tom to you speak of, child. <laughs> he's not actually a Tom to, for one thing. He's my little brother. I lost him like everyone else. <laughs> you have a Tom to brother you wish to rescue. I called him the same when we lost her. A family of humans who revere the Tomta! <laughs> A treasure more rare than the diamonds of this cave. You must save him, Tomta sister. Oh, that's the chief Tomta. I see, I hadn't realized. Hi, Spidey. Child, listen, she fears the light. So? This is the Crystal Kingdom of the Tomta. It used to reflect sunlight. Okay. Be silent or you'll be talking with my mouth full of you. I don't think that's quite... I think you've garbled your metaphors there, Widow Drow. <laughs> Release the light. Oh! Hello. Well, I'll make a piece of both of you. Give me a rare treasure of this tale, so I have a little magic to repay you. Oh, thanks! Why didn't you do that and cut yourself down ages ago? Oh my god! He's just gonna die, I guess! Oh god, there's so many tons to tied up around here. Jesus. <laughs> I hope you'll be okay. He won't. Uh oh. Uh oh. You're trapped in here with me. I think this is the point where I say, no, you are trapped in here with me. Oh my god! <laughs> I hate this game. Stop being in my brain. <laughs> I don't even know what that reference is from originally. I only know it because everyone else on the internet knows it. Oh my god. Your turn to run. Oh my god. <laughs> Girls are the mightiest of humans. Don't you know anything? A mirror. Hooks. They can be attached to the wall. Ow. <laughs> I'm joking. Hang on a sec. Oh my gosh, okay, well, I, my throat lives just about, Jesus. I shouldn't have laughed so much. Wow, that's bright. She hates it. Car said light. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I see. Okay. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, okay. There was a cool shadow effect when I ran past it. Once. Um, okay, I suppose this bit is technically puzzle platforming. <laughs> What I want to know is who, given, like at some point, presumably, they figured out, hey, we're under attack by a giant spider who's tying us all up and eating us. <clears throat> so who went around closing all of these shutters when that happened? That's what I want to know. Go with me, I will tie with you once I have you. A bracket for a mirror, okay. Let's see, what's this? A lot of these things are quite annoying to actually try and interact with. Hello? Nope, okay. 
Whatever it is, I guess I'm not allowed it. Okay, I can't pick them up. This one says, a tiny spider called Petta. Okay, you think that's a place for now, is it? Oh, maybe I wasn't far enough over, hang on. Because <clears throat> this is actually still a 3D environment. I was just treating it like it's 2D. Maybe I was having trouble interacting with it because I need to be... Yeah, we go, that's what the problem was. You're right though, there's a bracket for a mirror. As is this. Why are there two brackets here? What does that do anyone? Mm. This one says Peta Edekop is a Norwegian version of the Itsy Bitsy Spider. Oh, that's cute. <clears throat> I had no idea. Hmm. I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to be doing here, to be honest. Well, we've got two brackets, two places we can potentially put this. We'll try them both. Okay, that was a bad one. <laughs> Is she gonna do this every time I put a mirror in front of some light? You can go up and down and up and down. New plan. Can I get the other mirror? This one. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. I see. Okay. Jessica says, can you not rotate the mirrors? Uh, I, no, the only option I've got is pick up and put down. Right, I need to put this back though. Oh, and they have different angles, possibly. Hang on, if I like that. Like that one. Yeah, ah, I see. Ah, okay. Um. Does this help me? I'm not sure. We'll find out. I might be about to die. Just so you know. Okay. I need I need that mirror. The one that's up there. I don't know how to get to it. Oh, there's a climbing wall here. Ah, <clears throat> sneaky. Real sneaky. I mean, even if I tire, it's not like the light will tire. So I don't know what good you're expecting that to do you. Right, I can't climb up because she's there. Okay, let's go. Let's go put this back. Doop. Let's. That one there. Ah, okay, there's a hatch. Mm -hmm. I see, hang on. Oh, 
We're, f we're working it out slowly. Up and left, I guess we're going up. And we've got up, left, and right. Ah. That. We're going over here. Oh, I'm sure we'll need this one open. I can't imagine why we'd ever need it shut. Then I can do what I was going to do before over there, I guess, but only after I've got this one set up. Okay. Now we put you here. Boop! Then we steal this one. It's dark down here, but it's fine because you can't get here. Uh, up. Over here. So you keep saying, and yet, I'm confident that I will escape. Okay, go up. More, there's another Tonta there. I want to go up one more if I can. Yeah, over there, over this. Probably easier with Tonta powers. <laughs> yeah, probably. I imagine most things are. Right, I don't think I want to go over there just yet. Let's see if we can hop down here. Hi there! <laughs> Can't get him out yet. Right, and then there's this. Which I guess... I need to now, because now I've got the other light shining on this. So now I need to go down and rejig that first light so it shines up. On the, the first mirror instead of the, uh, the second mirror. Yes, shut up, Widow Drow. I'm busy. Can you not see that? I don't want to be up here. I don't want to be up there. I'm an empty. I need to go this way around. Pick up both mirrors. You are correct, Chasquad. I honestly, uh, there was definitely been times when I'm like, if I was that spider, I'd just shut my eyes and dip in. Although actually, now that I say that, I'm not sure spiders can shut their eyes. So I guess that might be why. I think I merged with the wall there slightly. Yes, I definitely did. I'm sure that's fine though. Hmm. Uh, point up. Drama Queen! <laughs> if only. Okay. Now we, I'm fairly confident I remembered to open that grate. Let's hope. Yes! Fantastic! Not more accursed sunlight. Don't worry, none of this is sunlight. Right. I think 
I go for the, uh, the dagger now? Well, let's, let's also see what's over here. Okay, over there there's that. Maybe I... Okay, I think I need that one to get the dagger, because that's out of the sunlight. It says you don't have the pain of being oversensitive to light. Oh, I didn't know that you knew the pain of being oversensitive to light, Boo Boo. I'm very sorry to hear it. Well, that's not where I really was hoping you'd go, to tell the truth, because uh, cause that's where my sword is. Hmm. It's been webbed shut. Okay, I guess I need the dagger. Well, there's only one thing for it. Let's hope we don't get eaten. Yoink! Hmm. Don't think a direct attack hmm. will work. Okay, let's see if we can go and free the other top tower. Let's be buds. Where did all the rest of my stuff go? I had like a horse head sculpture and things. Oh! Oh, okay, I've, I've got them all now. Getting the dagger got everything. Marvelous. <laughs> the answer is yeet. Yeet the dagger at the spider, should I? Hello. Bop, bop, bop. And you're free. Dump to. Bye. I guess he didn't want to be put in my journal. Haha. <laughs> yeah, I suppose that makes sense. Find a way. Ta da! Oh, yeah, we shot the spider with a laser beam. That was for trying to eat. And for actually eating lots of other people. Because, uh, yeah, old, uh, old Chief Tompter, he's not there anymore. He's very dead. Rip him. <laughs> Uh, oh, there's lots of different ways to go. I want to see what happened to the spider. I want to go this way. Oh, apparently I can't climb over there anymore. Never mind. I wonder if I can pick those mirrors up again. Hi guys. Bop! Hello. You defeated- Oh, this is the chief! Hi there, how'd you get free? Our kind will ever be in your debt. Apart from the ones she already ate. I feel like you could have done this at any time, honestly. You didn't have to wait for me to show up. Thank you, I'd never got free if it weren't for you. We would never be free if it weren't for you. How can we repay your strength and kindness? Okay. Stand on the stone here. 
I'm not sure which stone, but I don't want I don't want to get out yet, so uh, I won't be doing that just yet. <laughs> I'm not even well as a black kid. <laughs> you raise an excellent point, Boom Boom. I haven't got around to that one yet, but uh, they don't seem to mind. Hi. You okay? You're being slowly digested after having been injected by spider venom? Nah, they're gonna wait for me to do it, aren't they? The lazy little tonters. Chappy chop. Snip snip. Boink. I didn't even see where that one went. He didn't go in the hole. Hey. <coughs> Tom -tom. Okay, we now have three Tomters. I feel like there might be a fourth sneakily hidden somewhere. You never know. What's up here? What's up here? There we go. Tom Tom number four, I knew it. Ha 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 ha. You thought you could outsmart me, game? Tom to cocoon. <laughs> Except unlike a butterfly cocoon, when the Tomta comes out of this, it'll actually have transformed into a whole bunch of little baby spiders. But are even now crawling around inside his little Tomta flesh and eating his little Tomta body. Yes. Bye bye. I'll see you downstairs in like 20 seconds. So, are these the only. Are these the last four Tomtas left? Or the last four cave Tomtas left? Is that what I'm getting here? Hello. <laughs> I wonder if I can actually go back and pick up those mirrors. I don't think they're likely to be useful to me, but if I can, then that means they might be. <laughs> uh, if you have a quote you want added, I'm sure Shesko can do it for you. Shesko does have that power now. Steal your mirrors, Tomtos. Answer: No, I cannot. That's honestly probably for the best. <laughs> yes, because of that. Because of what Chesco just said. <laughs> uh, yes, you. Sh in theory, you should have the power of quotes. It's a, it's a, I've, I've marked people as regulars in their quotes on uh, Streamlabs and, and, and regulars is the role that I've given permission to put quotes for. Just so that it's not like anybody randomly showing up and like spamming the N word or something in quotes when they realize they can, you know? <laughs> what a great first quote to add, wonderful. Um,. Oh, pat, boom, boom, oh no. Okay, I'm on the stone, now what? <laughs> they make it fly! Whee! Jingle jangle. <laughs> Bye! I won't forget you! Or your species, after you slowly die out because there's only four of you left. Whee! Yes, all of the architectural problems have now been solved. What hasn't been solved is the question of how the sunlight got down there in the first place. And also, why didn't the bear wake up when I blew- Oh, for God's sake, not again. 
They are weak, useless, and diseased. Uh Oh god. Oh god. Mr. Bear, I need you! Ah! You <laughs> like a sorry for Mass Effect. I told you that Guardian is never returning. I'll fight you. Oh my gosh, she got eaten. Oh boy. Oh, ho, 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 boy. She got proper eaten. <laughs> oh, thank you, Dion. That was, uh,. Just in the nick of time, am I awake or dreaming still? No human child may enter here. Reveal yourself. Hi. New badge unlocked, Bear Rouser. Oh yeah. Are you an offering to yet and beyond strongest of guardians? Why does everyone eat people, for God's sake? I'm tough, mightiest of... Girls, I need your help. The guardians served their human whim. We learned this lesson. Interesting. We protect the realm, don't interfere in multiple concerns. Do not disturb me again. What are you protecting while you're sleeping? Uh oh. Don't taunt the bear. My brother was taken through a portal by a monster. Portal opened? Impossible. No, very possible. Uh, so it says because they're yetin, that's kind of what they do. It's just like the only thing in this forest I've met so far that doesn't eat people are, m are the trees. That's literally it. Everything else eats people. I think Fossengrim eats people, the Nukan eats people, the trolls eat people, the cat eats people. The giants eat people, the spider eats people. Actually, the Tom's have don't eat people. But it's just those two. Everything else here eats people. There's not even any people in this forest. Why is everyone living here if they love eating people so much? Um, Kirk says, hibernation is very important for bears. If you interrupt it, they won't be able to go back to sleep and eventually die. Really? I'm surprised by that, because I thought that hibernating animals did typically, like, interrupt their own hibernation to wake up a little bit every so often. Who asks, do the people eat people? I mean, I'm the only people in this forest so far, and I don't eat people, so I'm going to go with no. Unless she has grown strong, and that abomination- oh my god, you guys! No. Dream torment, that's all it is. Okay, the thing on your face. Your sister the wolf had the same parasite. I wonder if it was possible for me to come here first, and if so, what I'd say. If I'm in its grip, I have no strength left to fight it. I can! I helped your sister, let me help you. Perhaps you're as mighty as you say. Yes, I am the mightiest of girls! What didn't you get about that? And it says, It's the difference between waking naturally and waking to a water balloon in the face. Fair enough. And says, Might only be bears, maybe it's fine if they interrupt it themselves. Oh, okay. I'm learning things. I always learn things from you, Shaskor. You always teach me stuff. Uh, you must indeed be brave to reach this place alone. Very well. Have a look. It's in exactly the same place it was before. I'm still not going to be able to reach it over this massive bear pool. It's definitely not. I can reach it, and now I'm going to have nightmares. Hooray! Right. Now, the last set of nightmares took me a lot longer than 10 minutes to get out of. This is completely dumb. Oh, that's not true. Uh, yeah. 
yeah, so, uh, the last lot took a lot more than ten minutes, so I'm probably just going to cut off halfway through when we get to three o'clock. Uh, no version of home, just like it was before. Well, mostly. Yeah, uh, everything floating and being underwater will do that to a home. Make it not feel very homely. Hello! No, that's fair enough, Tom. I don't really like this either. I've never had a dream like this before. Down we go. Ah, okay, everything's slightly more attached to the floor this time. It's all just like you left it. It is not all just like you left it. When you left it, it had like five holes in the ceiling and was on fire. That's true, I suppose, Jessclaw. <laughs> I hadn't considered that. Maybe I trust you too much. That's fine. Um, under the sheet, anyway. I don't give it a yoink. A piano! I mean, who has Shaskor? Who has? What's that one to you? Goes do 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 Oh. I can't remember, but apparently my dream can. Uh-oh. Unfortunately, my basement is allergic to music. This is a very severe allergic reaction. Oh, good. Okay. I see. Uh. Right, I, I can't remember the notes. I guess I have to. Oh! Portals! Because I have to do that. Interrupting someone while they're sleeping just seems impolite. Well, that is true. Interrupting someone so that they can save you from a man-eating spider, and then so that you can cure them of their hideous, nightmare-inducing fungal parasite plague, I think is a lot less impolite. I'm going to go so far as to say that is actually polite. Oh my god. We're out on... Bloody balcony with our bloody drunken father again. Mm. Right, so we've got a clock that's not supposed to be here. What we'll time change if the clock does? Interesting. We'll come back to that. Mama would drink because she's not an alcoholic. It's still hot, which means it's time to see McDonald's. Jeez. So you'd rather have pickled herrings. Okay, so this isn't actually our father, it's our mum in disguise, is what I'm getting. This spot feels empty, it needs wind giants. Find you soon, Papa. Then we can give you a proper burial. If the cremation wasn't enough. Okay, this flower pot looks out of place. Okay, let's go see what the clock does. Must be run and managed regularly, sleep or no sleep. Oh, hello. Hmm. If you said to midnight, will Armageddon start? I hope not. My room, and I'm like a year to. Hmm. I could 
play with our room like a dollhouse. Including, I guess, baby Lars? Aww. I don't think you were ever this little, Tom. Well, I mean, like, when you were still like a little fetus, I suppose. But but you didn't look like that. Looks like he's air drumming. He never liked the quiet games. Ergo, he needs a non air drum. Okay, we found the wind chimes. I think you could be used as a drum. There we go. Chimes back. where all of these food things go, perhaps? Yes! Oh, now I'm tiny! I'm little, a tiny tumta, like she called me! Mama left food, but it just brought a mouse. Which is why we got a cat, I suppose. Water bowl is empty. Am I gonna give the cat coffee? This is a terrible idea. I hope this isn't what I have to do. Oh no. I hope the cat doesn't try to drink this. Well, why did I put it there then? Okay, the cat's after a canary. Or what other brand of yellow bird? Songbird, Shelley, I forgot you too. Mm. You would sing beautifully. Is it going to turn out that it's my fault that the bird and the cat died mm -hmm. as well? Just like how it was my fault that all my mum's stuff got thrown down a well. Mm. Oh, I've already done this one. Thank you, thank you. Oh, stop it! Mm. <laughs> ah. oh. I've got the problem, like when you're spam clicking to try and get out of the. the Pokemon Center dialogue. Spam clicking to try and get out of the dialogue here as well. Oh, I can't reach anything. Okay. Tough bringer of death. I hope not. So the other pants are. They bang about her and I grabbed one. Okay, do I need a way up there to get that to Lars then? Dust feet, cheese and biscuits, empty cup. Can I put the coffee back in the cup? No. Can I distract the cat with cheese and biscuits? Says this is why we spam B and Pokemon. Yes, but I don't have a B button to spam. I mean, I've got a B button, but it doesn't cycle through dialogue. Uh, okay. None of this is helping get me any closer to remembering a piano. Oh, can I hide the bird cage under the dust sheet? There we go. Distract the cat. Shall we sing? So familiar. 
It's the same tune. Ah! I see. Hello? Paper? There's musical notes. Fantastic. Now I can play the piano. Oh, I don't know what else any of the other puzzles are. Oh, okay, I have to use the sheet story. It's the start of the tune. Okay. That sounds nothing like that song, that song that. All right, well, on that disappointing piano solo, I think we're going to break there. Uh, we've got a lot of this puzzle left to do, uh, but we are one and a half of the uh, Guardians down now, which I am quite happy with. I'm guessing that there's only going to be one more stream of Rookie, which is sad. But I don't actually know how long the game is. But it feels like we're sort of most of the way there. Uh, I want to say a big thanks to everyone for hanging around in the chat, for Boom Boom and Chesscore uh, in particular, for, for giving me lovely individuals to bounce off of. You know, I think you're lovely people. Uh, it's always a pleasure to have you. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow at 8pm British time, my, my Thursday evening streams. Playing dot 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 question mark something. Uh, don't know what it's going to be yet. Haven't decided. Uh, I am hopefully going to send you all off on a little raid. It's just a couple of us, but it's fine. Uh, who's live? Oh, Anne Marie is live. Should I go visit them? Yes. Only if I can spell the word raid, though. There we go. Uh, you know the drill, but I'm going to say it anyway. Uh, you're lovely beans. Maria's a lovely bean. Be lovely to each other. Uh, comport yourselves with, with dignity and stuff. And uh, make sure that, that they feel loved when we get there. Uh, other than that, the usual, you can find me on Twitter at this for demise on masterneldritch.cafe slash at this for demise, where you'll be able to learn what I'm going live with tomorrow when I send up my usual stream notification. Uh, other than that, I hope you'll have a wonderful rest of the day, and I will see you all, hopefully, next time. Ta-ra! Bye everyone, enjoy your raid! Bye!